morning everyone welcome to my coffee and chalk this morning thank you for watching the replay if you are watching the replay can you please type replay if you are watching me live can you please say hello this morning I am coming to you live from my laundry room and please ignore the fact that um, I don't have one of those pretty laundry rooms it's um, just my washer and dryer and a utility sink. Um, up there is a heat press where I heat press to make shirts and all that stuff. And then all of the laundry stuff is just there. I wish I had a really pretty um, laundry room, but I don't. Um, uh, so yeah, so ignore my unorganized laundry room. Um, but let me go ahead and quickly share this. Um, because, like I always say, I want my VIP peeps to get to see this too. And um, if you are not in my VIP group, you need to be in my VIP group. Why? Because um, that is where I have all of my um, specials, deals, bundles, um, anything like that. Um, so that is all in my VIP group. So you need to be in that group in order to have access to those specials. Um, so I had a lot of um, I had a lot of promotions going on um, yesterday, last day of the month. Mm. So keep a lookout for March because I'll be having some more promotions. Um, but with it being the first day of March. Um, I have not posted any yet, so, um, but happy March, you know, um, actually my birthday is in March, so I'm a March baby, um, so it's my birthday month, right, don't we get a whole month? Um, yeah, so, also I'm gonna share this to my, um, oh wow, you can add this to your story not know that. Let's try that and see what happens. I've never done it before. Does it work? <laughs> no. I don't know how to do that. Okay. Anyhow, I'm just going to show this in my timeline. Okay, so that my friends and family can see what I'm doing as well. So, I wanted to show you guys something really fun. Um, I know you've seen me do the refrigerator, but today we are going to do my washer and dryer. And I want to show you, again, how versatile this stuff is and how you can really, like, just spice up different um, places in your house. Like, you don't necessarily need to have, like, a frame or anything. Like, you can literally chalk anything. Okay, so what we're going to do today is I have laundry open 24-7. That is going to go right here. And then we have wash and dry, and that is going to go over here. So I'm pretty excited about that. So let's go ahead and get started. So I'm going to fuzz this. I don't have a marker to write on the back. That's okay. Um, so I'm going to fuzz this because I'm putting it on a sleek surface. So I wanna make sure that it doesn't get stuck or stretch out or anything. So I'm fuzzing on my new fuzzing cloth. So just like that, like I just put it on the cloth and then pull it off. Um, I know you guys used to see me put it on my shirt, but now that I got the new fuzzing cloth, I don't have to do that anymore. Um, so if you want um, a fuzzing cloth, let me know and I'll hook you up with that. Um, because it is really, has become helpful instead of me putting it on my shirt like I always do. <laughs> but, so I'm going to fuzz this a few times so that, like I said, so it doesn't, um, isn't super sticky for the sleek surface and... Um, so that when I pull it off, I don't stretch it. Okay. So, all right. So we got this right on here. Let me know if you can't see. Maybe I should do this so you can see better. There you go. Okay. So we got this right on the laundry machine. I'm using white chalk um, over here. So, I'm trying to see what the best angle is. 
because I am in your way for sure. Okay, so I have already stirred this guy up, so we should be good with that. All right, so we are just gonna go ahead and start jocking. So, I will say it's definitely different chalking on something that's upright instead of laying flat. Um, I am a little bit messier. Ah. Um, also, this is at an angle also, so it's a little bit challenging. because the wash machine like angles inward. But you know what? The best part about this chalk is that it washes off. So this chalk that I have dripped here, um, I can just wipe it off. I should have brought um, a towel over here. Okay, so now we're gonna wipe off the excess since we got it all covered. All right, so ready for our peel and reveal, my favorite part. All right, and like I said, the stuff that I dripped here, no big deal because it just wipes off. Um, didn't grab a rag though. That's okay, I'll figure it out. Okay, so let's go ahead and peel this. How awesome is that? I love it. Okay, so I'm gonna stick this in the sink right here for me to wash it when we are done. And I'm also, Okay, sorry about that. I also wanted to grab a wet wipe. So these are super handy. I have a whole container of these in my art space because um, they are super handy for cleaning squeegees, wiping off my hands, <laughs> and cleaning up mistakes like we're gonna do right here. So you see, like I dripped here. So all I have to do is wipe it off. Same with right here. All I have to do is wipe it off. That's what's awesome about this. And the other awesome thing is if I get sick of this and I don't want this on here anymore, um, I'll just take a wet wipe and wipe it off. So that's the other really cool thing about it. But look how great that looks. I'm super happy with that. So, all right, let's move on to the dryer. So we are gonna go do the dryer now. Um, and let me move over. Okay, so let me, oops. Angle us by the dryer so that you can see what I'm doing here. And my apologies that my head is a little bit cut off, but that's okay. All right, so moving on. So we got our fuzzing cloth. We're gonna take our next um, transfer here and we are going to fuzz it. Oh, sorry, I'm like trying to get this. I know my head's cut off. Um, but hi, Yvette, how are you? Where are you watching me from? I am excited to have you on this morning. But yeah, isn't this cool? It's so much fun that I can put this pretty much on anything, um, any surface. You can literally chalk anything. That's why I love this so much because I literally look around my house or whenever I go to the store and I'm like, hmm, can I chalk this? Can I chalk this? So 
It's funny because that has like become my life now. When I'm at the store, I'm like, I see something and I'm like, ooh, I could totally chop that. <laughs> so, but it's super fun. And like I said, if you get sick of it, you could just wipe it off. Um, but it won't wipe off, um, like, cause it'll dry there and I'll be able to rub my hand over it and it won't come off. So, um, so it's not going to come off unless you want it to. So that's good. Especially since washer and dryers, um, well, washer is near water, can get wet, but it is not going to ruin that design. So, okay. So now that we fuzzed this guy, let's go ahead and get it on here. Centered it up. All right. And the dryer is not slanted. So this is going to be a little bit easier than the wash machine. But I'm excited. Cool. So, okay. I've been wanting to do this. I would love to hear from you guys what other appliances you think that I should try chalking on. Okay, let's see if I can give you like a better angle. Um, because I would definitely love to try anything. Because <laughs> the cool thing is that, you know, if you hate it, you can take it off. It's not like paint where it's like permanent and I just like, you know, ruined my washer and dryer. No, it's just fun. And it adds a little bit of spice and design to my laundry space with a quick and easy project. So something quick and easy that you can do that can just add something to um, kind of a dull space. And my laundry room is definitely a dull space. So once all that's covered, good there. I'm just going to scrape off our excess. All right, so yeah, I'm just gonna scrape off the excess here and then we will do our peel and reveal. And then we'll be done with this project. So. And it sounds like my baby's waking up, so it's a good thing that we are almost done with this. And my dogs are acting crazy. All right, good to go, good to go. Take that little wet wipe, clean all this ink off of me. I'm so messy. I'm like the messiest person when it comes to like art and paint and stuff. You get stuff everywhere. Okay, so here we go. All right, guys, how cool is that? Okay, let me put this in the sink to wash that for later. And this one I didn't drip anywhere, so there's nothing to clean off. But so let's take a look at this. Look at that on my washer and dryer. Ah, oh, that's so cool. Love it. All right, well, that is our project for the day. So let me know if you um, would like to see any other projects, like if there's any other surfaces that you want to see um, if I can chalk on, because I would love to do it. Um, and let me know if you are interested in any um, of the um, bundles that I have, or if you want me to put a bundle together for you, I would love to do that so that you can try stuff. Um, but yeah, let me know if you're interested in trying out these products and um, I will catch you guys tomorrow. All right. Thanks a lot for watching. Really appreciate you. And thanks for watching. Cheers.